We are preparing to do the show Anything Goes, which is a show that documents the lives of several characters and their interactions aboard a cruise ship on its way to London. Mr. Kandari is the director of the show and he has a lot more roles actually than most directors would. He's teaching us music and he's doing a lot of the set and props and costumes and he's really good with like the artistic vision. It's my first musical here at PK Young as director. We have a fine tradition of high-level musical theater experiences for the kids and community. So I tried to pick a show that could continue in that tradition, but also maybe something that was a little more classic. We've had some really great, insightful people come and help with this production, and I think that's, that's really helped a lot. I know that bringing Elliot Bradley, that there will be that he's a really good taskmaster on choreography and will have specific ideas and really great at teaching and conveying those ideas to students. With a show like this, you have to teach lines, you have to teach music, not only the, the lyrics, but also harmonies and parts and who sings what, just trying to convey the message and what the audience needs to get from their performance in such a short amount of time is really challenging, but they've done a really, really, really good job. I know that Justin Greer is able to take the, the characters and have conversations with the students to understand exactly what each moment is about. With his huge knowledge of musical theater, he's been in like nine straight Broadway shows. He was actually in the um, newest revival of Anything Goes on Broadway, which is just was just amazing to get his perspective. We are all trying to sort of discover this story together and discover who these people are together. And I'd like to think that I'm here to help them understand that their, what their role is in this is to create something that's alive, that's real, that comes from them, so that they can interact with each other in a natural way on stage. It's really not about the finished product. So a lot of people, when they put together a musical, were worried about and not that we're not worried about these things, but the focus is on the, the set and the dancing and the sound and making it look like something instead of discovering a script and discovering music and discovering all those things together. And, that's, and I think when more time is spent on the discovery and all of the things, it, it, it uh, provides for a more informed performance and actually you get a better result than just worrying about what is the finished product. I think that the students appreciate the camaraderie that I'm trying to form. My big push is that it's that we are a unit, we are an ensemble. N no one is more important than the other. Everyone says there are no small parts in theater, and it's true. We've talked a lot about with the ensemble uh, members coming up with a name for themselves and creating their own backstory so that they really come to life on stage. It's kind of what takes it to the next level and makes the show believable. And once those things start happening and you see the cast helping each other, um, that's where that, that whole idea of uh, family and camaraderie is built. And the guest artists that I brought in and myself, we stress that this isn't just for musical theater. It's never just putting on a show. It's learning life skills that they can apply to anything they do, no matter what they go do in their life. It's professionalism. It's responsibility, work ethic. The way that we take responsibility for our contributions is the same if you're a scientist or studying for a math test or leading a group. So it's not just about these students going on and being great stars um, on Broadway, but they can be great stars in whatever they do in life.